Hello everyone, my name is Bambi and uh, welcome to my channel. Now today we're going to be playing some Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. Wow, that was a long title. Um, yes, I have played this before. I've also played 2015 and 16. Um, or not 16, just 2015. I played Car Mechanic 2015. Um, and I've played this game actually a lot. Um, as you guys can see, uh, the, no, the money in the XP is not legit. I did some uh, mods and stuff on here, so, you know, raking up on this game is just ridiculous. Um, so, yes, I did do some cheats on it, um, but uh, I know some stuff about cars. Um, I'm not going to say I'm an expert, expert at knowing cars, but I do know, do know my stuff about cars. Um, so this game is, is, is cool for me. I love I love car mechanics simulators. I love cars. I love s s parts about cars. Just you know everything about cars. Um, so today on this first episode of this game, um, we're gonna go down to the barnyard and uh, pick up a, a rusted car and just pretty much just build it from scratch. We're gonna take everything out, uh, weld it, and you know just clean it up, paint it put some new parts in there, take it out for a test drive, and see how it runs. So, most likely I am trying to get like a muscle car or some sort. Um, abandoned airport? What is there? Oh no, you have to test your... Okay, well I haven't actually played this game in a while, so... Um, I don't really know much. I, I did do all my barn finds and stuff, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and go to the junkyard. Um, I forgot what I was saying. God dang it. Oh, I do have all the DLC packs. I have the Dodge DLC and the Mazda DLC. Um, so I'll have be able to find the Dodge and the Mazda cars if there is any in this barnyard. Um But uh yeah, let's go to our search here and see if we what we can find. Um so far no good, nothing over here. Uh, it's kind of dumb. You cannot sprint. Ooh, what's this? This is an old... I think this is a Cadillac or is this a Chevy? Oh, it's a, I think it's a Chevy Impala. Uh, 1969? 67? I don't know. I don't know what the year is at on that. Um, ooh, that's a nice one. Uh, that's gonna have to be a maybe. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of these cars, really. More of into the actual oldies muscle cars. Um, let's see if we find anything over here. Nothing over here. Uh, wow, his footsteps are really loud. Hopefully the audio is good. Uh, I did try to record some uh, LSPDFR earlier, but just everything, every time I try to, you know, do for that game when I try to record it always said my storage was too much or it just wouldn't record whatsoever um so I, I don't know what was going on with that um well we so far we can't find anything I'm gonna go back to the garage and come back to the barnyard and see if we can find some different stuff so new stuff can spawn so um yeah I'll be right back alright and we're back to the barnyard um <clears throat> Like I said, we couldn't find anything on first time, which so far we're finding the pretty much the same exact thing as we found before. Um, if, you know, worst comes, you know, we'll just take this car if we can't find anything. Um, but I really hope we find at least something good in here. Ooh, what is this? Hello. What are you? So much rust, I don't know what you are. You are a definite maybe. If we can't find anything else, that is definitely what we're going to be going for. And what is this? Uh, just regular, you know, coupe or whatever the fuck that kind of car is. So, I think that car over there is going to be pretty much our trophy. Our trophy car. What we're going to do. Ooh, what's this over here? Is this... Is this what I think it is? No way. If this is what I think it is, then this is going to be the best find I've ever found in my life. I, I just... 
I'm not sure what. What? I. I guess there's only one way to find out. It's if we get it. I. I. I'm. I'm confused. I don't. I don't know. I. I have no idea. I, I can't figure out if I've. If I know what that car is. It's so rusted. They put so much detail in this game. Um. I think we're just gonna go for the other one for now. Only because I don't want to, you know, get that car and, you know, put it all together and it's just end up not being the car what I think it is, which I think I know what it is, and I just cannot think the name of it. Um, but if if that car end up, if you guys end up enjoying this V's videos and I make more, I think I'm going to end up, you know, finding another car like that and just fixing it together. But this, don't know what it's called. No idea, but I'm definitely going to try to get this car, fix it up, and uh, put this car back to moving again. Um, so we're going to purchase this car. Wow. Um, <laughs> yeah, a lot of stuff that needs to be fixed. $7,900. What are you doing? Jeez. All right. Well, Um. sure. I guess let's do it. We have the money. Why not? Go to the garage. Okay, let's go back to the garage. And we're back to the garage with this rusty piece of crap. So let's move it to the lift. And let's fix her up. See what she's got going on under the hood. Absolutely nothing. Yeah, this thing is beat up. All right, well, we're going to swap out the engine. We're going to take it out, put it on the the engine stand, and um, put the engine, you know, together and stuff and, you know, take everything off this freaking... Well, actually, you know what? Yeah, let's take off all the all the parts. Let's, first things first, got to take all the parts off. Every single part known to man on this freaking car. The headlights, the freaking underneath... Bumpers, fenders, wheels, just just everything needs to go. Is that what? Is that literally it? There was literally nothing in the car. Literally nothing on the car. Oh well. But uh, we're gonna put this on the lift. To get rid of everything that's underneath the car, like the transmission and. You know, the tubes and freaking the stuff for the car. Like, yeah, pretty much. Just, you know, everything that needs, everything just needs to go. Like, the mill muffler, the freaking drive shaft needs to go. Freaking unscrew all these freaking bolts that are probably just rotted onto the freaking transmission. But pulling them out like it's nothing, you know, because it's legit. Um,. Let's take these wheels off. These wheels are just... They they just say tetanus all over you. The more I take this car apart, the more I regret just taking... Just buying this car. The more I wanted to get the other one. Jeez. There's literally like... I barely... I've like spent like five minutes taking this car apart. And it's already pretty much already apart now. Because there's literally everything is missing from this car. Not one... You see a little silver there? That's literally all you'll see. Everything else is just tetanus. Like, this is just ridiculous. Even the fuel tank is freaking out of it. There is no fuel filter, but there is a fuel tank. Makes sense. Alright, so we pretty much got everything under the car taken care of. Uh, the only thing we really need to take care of is the front. And... Yeah. I didn't take the taillights out. Instead, go ahead and... Did no. Well, look at that. Once you know it, there's not another one. Who cares? All right, let's get get this engine out of here. Um, let's go ahead and move equipment. I think it's B. Yeah, it was B. Okay, cool. All right, engine crane. We're gonna go ahead and pull out to remove engine first. Unmount gearbox. Oh, I have to take out the freaking. Alrighty. Sounds good. Probably should have done that in the first place. Uh, take the exhaust out. 
Uh, the gearbox, take that out. Uh, and we should be good. Anything else that needs to be taken out? Nothing. Alright, cool. We should be good now. We should be able to take this sucker out, no problem. Whether we took that out or not, I should have been able to take that out because there's literally nothing in there. So, should be... Should be no problem. There we go. Cool. Alright, so no engine. The only thing I need to take out is like the suspension parts and stuff. Um, I'm going to take, actually while I'm at it, I'll take the radiator out. And let's take the brake servo out. And the battery. Where's the battery? There's the battery. Alright. So now we're just going to need to get the front out of there. And this car is completely empty. And actually, you know what? While we're at it. Let's go ahead and add it into crate. Yes. And there we go. Literally dead. Nothing. All right. Okay, so look. Look at this. Look at this real quick. Okay, so out of the whole entire wheel that's rusted, you know, whatever, the bolts seem to be fine. The, the bolts are more shinier than, like, anything else in the car. How did, How does that work? All right, so I got everything taken out of the vehicle here. As you can see, there's literally nothing in there. Um, we're going to go ahead and take the welder and uh, weld the shit out of this car because it is just... It is just brown. Nothing nothing else. So we're going to go ahead and uh, weld the shit out of this freaking car. There we go. Look how clean that is. That is awesome. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so now the engine. I just don't even. I'm I'm completely speechless right now. This is just. I should have just bought the other car. Why? Why didn't? Why didn't I just do that? Well, I, I don't know. Why? Why? Why do anything? Why do anything? Why do anything? It was missing another. Oh my god. Well, engine is now completely apart thank fucking god all right now we need to just completely buy a new uh engine which will be the next episode the only reason why i make it to another episode is because this 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 build with this engine is just gonna take completely just just forever like i don't even i don't even know what to say this car is just gonna take so long to put together and it's just a lot of time and you know effort and stuff so if you guys want to see part two just let me know uh in the comments and you know if you enjoyed you know leave a like subscribe and yeah that's pretty much all i have for you guys i'm gonna definitely try to make another um uh lspdfr video um and uh see what the issue is going on with that so yeah so so far we did um uh, we did do, we did do some progress. We took apart the car, took everything out of it. I mean, not everything. When you still got the steering wheel in there, which you probably could take out right now. And bada bing, bada boom, bada bop. There we are. Whoops. Um. But yeah, we get, now we got everything out of the car that needs to be out of the car. Um. It's stupid that you can't take the the bumper off, but um. Yeah, so got everything out of the car, got the windows out, got the engine out, all the engine parts are out. Um, actually, while we're at it, we can go ahead and repair all the stuff that we need to repair. Just rapidly clicking. And done. Cool. And while we're at it, you know what? Let's just do this. Let's 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 not let's not end it real quick and see if we can no. That is <laughs> no. Alright. Well, let's buy an engine block real quick. See if we can Or freeze. Oh, okay. Cool. Alright. Well, let's buy an engine block real quick and see what we can put together at this at this moment. Um, and then whatever, you know, I get to a point where I cannot, I just don't want to make any more or whatever. That's where I'll end the video. Just for you guys. Because why not? This car couldn't get any worse, so why not? Put the engine block in. 
And we are in the ignition distributor. 76 is good enough. Uh, fuel pump. There is no fuel pump. Oil filter. There's no oil filter. Water pump. There is no water pump. There is nothing in this car. Arm? Nothing. Crankshaft? Zero. This is where I'm ending the video. <laughs> that is, it's just, it's just getting worse every, every second. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please leave a like and subscribe if you guys are new. And any, any suggestions of what kind of games you want me to play, um, go ahead and leave a comment down below. And yeah, you guys have a good one.